an athletic super freak who cracked the NFL top 100 as a rookie. Play action here is yet again. Six foot four, 230 pounds. What a good catch by Matt. Couple his freakish size with elite 4-3 speed. If you're gonna play man-to-man -man against this monster, you better be able to find the football. There's not a lot of corners. They're gonna match up with him and he scored 49 touchdowns during his high school career. Watch this catch on third. That's a story right now with the oh, red. Oh, look at Oh, boy. Take the off, oh, man. That is the... Oh, my God. Oh, please take the camera oh, off. And don't geez. even bring it over there, please. Oh, my God. Just keep it away. Oh, oh terrible. Oh my, oh my God, what happened? You're wondering about athletes area, being what? paid. You can't pay a person enough money to go through what I just watched. Wow. Then watch quarterback Brandon Laverini roll out off the play action and gets to Nick DeMathis, who makes a nice catch, and it's first and goal Vikings at the Mount Olive 3, converting a big fourth down. And it's Mike Stefkovich connecting with a wide open Nick DeMathis for 38-yard reception to the Mount Olive 11, but Vernon is unable to score, and Mount Olive still has a 14-13 lead. And then watch Mount Olive running back Max White take off with a huge 81-yard gain as Nick DeMathis saves the touchdown at the Vernon 16. Huge play right there as we head to the fourth quarter. Hope John would answer on its next possession. It's Austin Bailey scoring from 67 yards out, and Pope John has a 7-3 lead with 10.43 left in the second quarter. The Lions get the ball back here on the fumble recovery and watch Sakai Rudolph weave his way back to the Vernon eight yard line in its first and goal Lions. But Mount Olive seals the deal here with a 62-yard pick six from John Lacone as Mount Olive tops Vernon 28-19 as Vernon falls to 2-7. Not happy. Not happy at all. Uh, you know, I, I respect to, to Mount Olive, but I, I really don't feel we played well. I don't think uh, I, I put, it, put it on my shoulders. So. I, don't, I don't know why we, we couldn't stop them. I thought we had our, our guys in good spots, but... Obviously, we did something wrong because we should have. I felt we should have won the football game. DK comes from an NFL lineage. Harris was an All American in Massachusetts 2001 when he was drafted by the Bears in the third round. He would start in the Super Bowl back in 2007. And do it all. Made it to the top level. In high school, DK was like a superhero, routinely making spectacular plays. His size allowed him to muscle past press coverage. DK is currently rated the number five wide receiver in the country, but it wasn't talent alone that got him to becoming one of the most sought after recruits in the state. But watch the great defensive play here by Nick DeMathis as the ball falls incomplete as Vernon stuns Pope John 24-17 to post their first win over the Lions since 2011 as they improve to four and four and keep their playoff hopes alive. Uh, undescribable, you know, we just beat uh, a great football team and uh, we're looking forward to next week now. No, we're not. We're, we're going to enjoy this for a little more, I think. Yeah. <laughs>